them there. The extra effort really paid off for that time. The Cincinnati Bearcats get that one and have now scored six unanswered points. Oklahoma Sooners kicks it back. The ball's up for grab. The Sooners continue to turn it over. They're playing a real sloppy game tonight. Crawford passes back outside. The Cincinnati Bearcats got a piece of the ball before coming out of bounds. The Sooners continue to turn it over. They're playing a they pass it inside. Love steals it away. John, here's where you don't want to rush getting it inside. They got too eager to shove it in, and the Number pass two. gets picked off. The Oklahoma Sooners call timeout.
takes the jumper. The Sooners with the ball, but they're down by double digits. He goes up. Kennedy can't connect from the high post. Good job guarding against the shot. That was a heads-up play on D. The Cincinnati Bearcats regain control. The Bearcats get that one and have now scored six unanswered points. Here's textbook low post. Get your position, get your man off balance by backing him down and set up for the shot. Superb basketball. This is a double-digit ball game now. Keller rips down another rebound. He now has 20 on the night. John, you gotta like how he ripped that one down. Maxie steals the ball. Good defensive execution right there, John, on the double team. They had him doubled and forced him into the desperation pass. Nice job. Crawford grabs the ball. Releases. That's his sixth point this game. They get another basket in the paint, John, and this is what's been the factor here tonight. They continue to pound the ball inside, and it's working very well for them. Maxiel kicks it out. Fire. William misses the tray. Not the easiest guy to guard on the floor because he's dangerous in that range. But he stayed tight and prevented the three. That's tough deep. Rejects that shot. Nice denial. They've been delivering those well on defense. It's showing the stats up there now. Oh, yeah, and I'm not surprised. Good defensive talent out there on the floor. The Bearcats recovery. Seven to go. Shot clock winding down. Gives it back. They get it down low. Kennedy takes it away. That's smart basketball. The double team works here down low because they contain his movement and then strip him of the ball. The Sooners get that one and have now scored six unanswered points. we've been hearing a lot about lately. As yes, John, he's showing us why right now. Take a look at the run he's got going for his team. Bad angle there, John. He's got to pinpoint his teammate for the pass and get it there in a hurry, or the D will be right there to step out of front. The Bearcats with the ball and a double-digit lead. Kicks it back, takes the three, and it fights 
him to rebound. Pulls down the offensive board, giving his team another chance. Swats it away for his team. Good, 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 good read by the defender there, John. He picked off that pass beautifully. He with the finger roll. They didn't get him the ball. Missed an opportunity there. Seven seconds on the shot clock. Throws it back. Very unfortunate. He's got four fouls, and on top of that, they're still behind. You need him to lay off the pressure on D, and that can cost you some easy baskets. Without him in the game, it's going to be a lot tougher to get back into the game. He can't get the first. He does nail the second free throw. Time is winding down, and this game is just about over. Yeah, just less than a minute to go now, and the huge deficit. He'll just play this one up. Use the experience for a coaching lesson in the last second comeback. He sinks the jump shot. That's the end of the game. Your final score. 99 to 79. What a game and what a season for these kids. It's been quite a ride for these teams to get to the Final Four and win and then get here tonight to the NCAA championship game. Both teams so incredibly talented and they should be very proud of their accomplishments. It's been a pleasure to be with you here throughout this fantastic season. So, for Tim Neverett and myself, John Ireland, I'd like to say thanks for being with us. So long. We'll see you in the fall.